bucket bow and today we will be assembling the Pro 88 wheelbarrow. Step 1. Unpack your parts and place your tray upside down, preferably on an elevated workbench. With your slam bracket, place it in the front of the tray recess and slide it back until it fits nicely. With your smaller under tray brace, you'll see there is a recess in the tray. Place that in there, making sure that the steel holes line up with the plastic holes on the tray and repeat the process for the rear brace. Step two, you will need to pair your arms together. To assist, we have applied white dots to one set of arms, match them up and slide the arms together. Place it down and same process for the second arm. Step three, place the arm down Refer to step three on the bolt diagram. When inserting the bolt, make sure that they're going in on the side with the square profile. So insert the bolts. With the stickers provided, place them over the top of the bolt. And repeat on the other arm. Step four, you will be placing your arms onto the tray. To assist, we have applied a white dot on one arm and a white dot on this side of the tray. This is to make sure that the logo is facing outwards. When lowering the arm down onto the tray, focus on matching up the holes of the arm with the tray and repeat the process for the second arm. Step five, you will be inserting your two middle tray mount bolts Refer to step five on the bolt diagram. A useful tip is to use the hex key provided, insert it in the hole and wiggle it around to line it up. Then insert the bolt from the outside inwards and apply the nut finger tight. Repeat on the other side. Step six, you'll be inserting the front and rear tray mount bolts. Refer to step six on the bolt diagram. Insert the bolt from the outside inwards. And the rear one. Apply the nut. This finger tight. Repeat on the other side. Step seven, you will be attaching your subframe to the arms. Lower the subframe over the bolts. Refer to step seven on the bolt diagram and apply the nuts finger tight. Repeat on the other side. Step eight will be attaching your front braces to the slam bracket. The front braces are slightly different. We have applied a white dot on one of them and a white dot on the tray. Refer to step eight of your bolt diagram. Pair these white dots up, ensuring the flat part of the brace is flat against the tray, inserting the bolt from the outside in and applying the nut finger tight and repeat on the second side making sure that you finish up with both braces pointing downwards. Step 9, you will be attaching your front strap and completing the front braces. The front strap has a white dot on one side which refers to the white dot on one of the arms. Place the strap over the arms, matching up the white dots and lowering it down until the holes line up. Refer to the bolt diagram step nine. Raise the front brace, inserting the bolt upwards through the brace, through the arm and through the front strap. Apply the nut finger tight and repeat the process on the other side. Step 10, you will be completing your wheel assembly and attaching it to the frame. Stand the wheel up on its side and insert the axle through the wheel. You'll notice that one side of the wheel has a white dot. Select the axle bracket with a white dot and pair these up. Put the other axle bracket on. Now you will notice there's a white dot on one side of the wheelbarrow. Keep the white dots all to the same side when lowering the wheel in. This will ensure that the tread pattern is in the right direction. Refer to step 11 of the bolt diagram. Insert the bolt up 
through the arm, through the strap, and through the axle bracket, and apply the nut loosely. Put the second bolt through. You may have to keep the wheel square to get the bolt through, and apply the nut, and I'll complete the other side. To complete step 11, you will need to line up your axle bracket with the holes in the strap and the arm. Insert the bolt upwards and apply the nut, finger tight. Put the second bolt in, apply the nut, finger tight to complete the wheel assembly. Step 12, your wheelbarrow is now assembled and it is time to tighten the nuts. Refer to step 12 of your bolt diagram. We have provided you with a double-sided tool and a hex key suitable for tightening the wheelbarrow. We recommend you start tightening from the front and work your way to the back, ensuring there is no gap between the steel when the nut is tight. When tightening your six tray mounts, they will stop at the correct tension. Thank you for purchasing your bucket barrow and if you require any further information, please visit our website, bucketbarrow.com. Thank you.